So you had the carpal tunnel surgery, oh, and it. so you're better. The pain isn't there. That's right. So we're going to do the rest of the story. How long ago did you have the surgery? Mm, six, seven years. Yeah. And let's just see how it's doing so far. Feel a little looser? Yeah, it does. And let me see you give me a little grip. Good. That's pretty strong. Yeah. Yeah. Good. Let me ask you a question. Mm -hmm. If you get pulled over by the cops and you haven't been drinking and they ask you to recite your ABCs, Can I do it? are you going to do it without singing them? Sometimes I can't bend it, sometimes I can't release it. So, as far as the overall arm, were we successful? Give me that grip again. Yeah, I got strength. Yeah. yeah, not bad, right? Yeah. You can, you can I can get... hurt your fingers. Though. Exactly, Thank you can hurt my fingers. <laughs> Payback. <laughs> right in here. Right oh, yeah? Here. Okay. It feels like, a, like when you strain it or something. But it just aches. How about when you make a grip? How strong is your grip? Uh, my grip is weak. So if you don't mind, I'm just going to go ahead and give you your grip back. And then we'll get the thumb. Does that sound good? Mm -hmm. Is that what happened? It's froze in there? It's definitely uh, contracted and, and a little bit glued together. Right right in there. Yeah. But it's already it's already loosening. It's not, not completely loose yet, but it's changing. Yeah. My, th my thumb even feels a little better. I blame you. <laughs> that feels a lot better. Yeah. The bad news is your wife asked me to hurt you just a little bit. That's my wife. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, tell me about, uh, you had a couple of accidents. You had some breaks? Broke my arms a few times. Okay. Um, and you're working as a mechanic? Work as a mechanic. Great. i um, been diagnosed with uh, rheumatoid arthritis in my right hand. Okay. And uh, it's a little bit up in age and starting to really affect me picking up. You're like 90? Uh, 95, <laughs> yeah. Let me actually see uh, how strong your hand is. Oh, it's, it's for a strong guy, that ain't your full, That's... yeah. Okay. How long has it been hurting? Probably about two years. Okay. When I work as a mechanic, I hit myself with hammers and, you know, I write it off to that. See, I don't have an excuse for hitting myself with a hammer. I'm not even sure I should be doing it. <laughs> I do it just to keep me awake. <laughs> wow. Okay, wow well, what? It's like my wrist was really bad this morning. It hurt. How's it feeling now? It feels good. You know I blame you, right? Why? Uh, just for the front of it? Sure, why not? My wife does all the time. <laughs> so that's a big difference, eh? 100% difference. Okay, and uh, in fact, I've never had a rheumatoid that didn't respond. Really? Yeah. I noticed your right arm... Uh, didn't feel like you were getting much grippage there. I don't. Okay. And uh, that's I get a lot of watches this way. That internal stress is really, really bad. Oh, I know. Yeah. And you have an irregular heartbeat. Yeah. You're right all the way. <laughs> I have rheumatoid arthritis. Okay. And like my whole body, everything's where I have carpal tunnel. Yeah. But I live, you know, I can't even. <laughs> You know, I, let me ask you a question. Did you get off of a tour bus with people with carpal tunnel and trigger finger? <laughs> I've mean? seen oh, everybody has, yeah. three of them so far today. Oh, really? Two no. trigger fingers no. and carpal tunnel. And, no. And, and, uh, I haven't and for into... probably 20 years. But I, I don't take on the Ford. I learned to go yes, with my pain. No. I'll let you go ahead and breathe, and then you can move it a little bit. Already, that'll be a little looser. Hasn't oh, yeah. changed the rheumatoid, but you can see it's a lot looser. Oh, yeah, very loose. Yeah. So it's not the night until 30 in the morning. Sitting up at night until 2.30 in the morning? It's just... That's because of the pain? Yeah. And uh, so now that it's better, uh, you can go back to work without worrying all the time? That's nice. That's nice. That's good. Okay. That's fantastic. Thank you very much. Yes, sir. My hand's been wrapped for two days. You're amazing. You're a magic uh, man. Thank you, dear heart. <laughs> I appreciate that. That means my neck. What's that? My neck stiff. Yeah, it goes all the way up. Yeah. I'll tell you what I will do for you right now. And all the way to the left. Just all the way. And all the way back. How's it doing now? Yeah, better. Yeah, it's looser now. I can oh, see yeah. it you're turning much better. That hurts all the time. Yeah, lately it's been Is it stiff now. or? Uh, pain. Yeah. Well, I'm going to have pain. you actually stand for me. Yeah. And then go ahead and gently bend. And you can put your hands on your knees if you need to. And you feel this in the ear? Yeah. And how far can you go now? Good. Exactly. Now let me have you come up. That's a problem. Perfect. Good. This is morning I couldn't get up. I blame you. 
Thank you. Yeah, see the back is usually I'll get down. Yeah. Once I'm up, I'm well, okay. Yeah, the neck is it's cracking, but it's good. Are we having fun yet? We're doing good. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, it just started several years ago, joint pain off and on, and getting worse, especially in the wrists. I just attributed uh, it to hard work. I work for myself, contractor. So I went for 20 milligrams and down to 7, so by next week I'll be off it completely. Joint pain goes right back. I don't inject anything. I just prefer to uh, fix the, the problem in the tissue and uh, have it be gone. Yeah, well, yeah, you realize when you have a lot of pain on a regular basis, why people do almost anything to get rid of it. It's a lot better. Believe it's a lot better already? A lot better. I blame you. Where's that 200 bucks? <laughs> What do you think? Huge difference. Huge difference. You sure? Oh, absolutely, I'm sure. Let me uh, give you a squeeze there. Uh, wait a minute, come on, come oh. on, come on. You, now squeeze me. Yeah. That's absolutely. pretty good, right? To be able I to do that? I my cousin here before. I was afraid to shake his hand because I hate a whippy handshake, and I can't share a confirmed handshake because it hurts. You know? <laughs> but no. I know what you mean. This is like... They never, and, they never actually said what it was. They ruled yeah. out... Did they, they touch your hands? Uh, very little. Yeah, isn't that amazing? You know, I've had a I had hundred foot tests, all kinds of other tests. They said, well, it's not rheumatoid arthritis, it's not this, it's not this, it's not this. And Apparently, this is the most expensive test of all, is to actually touch the problem. So again, I'm changing the tissue to make it normal, and your injury is not going to exist anymore. Obviously, you can see that we can kind of do a finger snap and you're better. Mark, you said you want me to hurt him a little bit? Give it to him. Be nice, honey. Teach him a lesson. No, he's very sensitive. <laughs> Do you love how you got a whole peanut gallery? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And uh, after you have that's a chance incredible. to recover, because... That's incredible. Yeah? It really is. That's incredible. That's, that's what you are. are. <laughs> <laughs> Let me try this. I was sitting around here, sitting on that bank. I couldn't get up off the bank watching the horses. I couldn't push down. Yeah. That's you were like, here, horsey. Here, horsey. <laughs> Why don't you move the high falls? I'll build you a condition on your house, you know. Yeah, we'll write that down. And that's right, you had the surgery. Right. You told me six weeks ago, right? Yeah. Yeah, they published the studies that show that placebo is more effective than arthroscopy. I'm sure. And since the surgery? Well, I've been in a lot of pain. Okay. Maybe you can get a refund on your uh, knee surgery. All right, let's see how you are so far. Nice and easy. That, yeah. Oh my God, that is such a relief. Yeah? Yes. I blame you. And now check and see all the stiffness is. Oh my God, yeah. Much better. I am like, so, like, shocked? <laughs> I'm so, yeah, like, like, oh my yeah, God. Yeah, go ahead and walk on it a little bit. <laughs> yeah, much, much, much better. Definitely. Yeah. A little change or a lot of change? Just a big change. Big change? Yeah. So what do they charge for? It's like 8000 for the knee surgery. We'll settle for four, okay? <laughs> okay. Were you walking with a cane? Yes. Yeah. Yes. Do so you think you need the cane now? or? No. Well, there you go. No. Let's see how far you can turn all the way to your right. And now your other right. I got you, didn't I? Feel better? Well, I've never had that kind of flexibility in my neck. <laughs> wow, that is amazing. Yeah. Well, gee, thank you so that'll much. help. Thank you very much. My pleasure. And uh, what's going on? Uh, I have arthritis in my knee. And I was just diagnosed. Okay. Much better. It looks to me like you're doing better. Well, thank you so, so much. You want to know I'm a registered nurse? Oh, excellent. Would that help? Yeah. yeah. I used to be on staff at uh, uh, Catskill Regional. Oh, my God. Yeah. I represented them as a nurse. Uh, for the New York State Nurse Association. Oh, I just put a needle in your ear, and mm -hmm. what happened? The heaviness in my back went away. You know, like the, it felt tired. It doesn't feel tired anymore. And what about you had a range of motion stiffness. problem in your neck? Yeah. And stiffness? It's gone. And yeah, we just did one uh, needle in the hand, right? Amazing. Yeah, did you say How spooky? How long is it going to last? <laughs> It'll stay. Last. You said spooky? Yes, yeah. it's, it is spooky. <laughs> Okay, so now when you come in to get your back, we'll also check your neck and see if they and we'll mm. do it quickly. Sound good? Sounds very good. Thank you, nurse dear. Thank you. My pleasure. All right. People used to come from all over the world when they could find me, but now I'm a country boy and yeah. and you got me, so